welcome, welcome to episode 25, yes, 25 of uh, Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Ah, right, well, this is another one of those I have never played. Um, and I have a horrible feeling we're going, we're going to be in for a Prince of Persia-esque type affair tonight. Uh, <coughs> as as we play lots of Castlevania badly. Yeah, I don't want to oversell it. Oh, no, no, close to thank you for subscribing for four months on the trot. It's very nice of you and much appreciated. Um, so yeah, Castlevania, uh, platformer. Shooty fighty, and by shooty I mean throw things type things, projectiles. Um, so let's have a look. We have a whole bunch, but just before the show started, I decided to move some to a different playlist because might we do something special for October? Might we possibly have four shows with spooky games on the run up to Halloween? We might. Who knows? Um, we'll give the wheel a little bit of a rest, perhaps. So, we have more than we've got. And, and I've got two that are called Castlevania 2. So, it's very possible we might start some of these and be like, oh, hang on a minute, we've played them. Now, normally, I would start the games and at least make sure they work. So, and I haven't this time. I, I'm just very much going in in the dark um but we're gonna start gonna start where it all not where it all began because it began on the famicom disk system but the nearest the nearest we can get to it all beginning is uh, is the nes yep we're starting with the nes and we're starting with as one would expect castlevania the very first one so let me move over to the little box and we'll get cracking, shall we? Whoa! Ah, dear. Right. Uh, so. I see. It starts without you, does it? about as much as we're going to get on screen so let's see Castlevania um, one, one of the biggest selling franchises in video game history and um, yeah never played it let's find out pushed start key Okay, jump, whip, Ooh, okay, what do they do, nothing, okay, so far so good, I like a, uh, I like a game that's only got two controls, speak too soon. In fact, I'm not going to speak too soon. Oh! Do I wish that I would have stayed up there? It's going to be a Castlevania player somewhere going, oh dude, you should have stayed there. Right. Oh. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna eat some meat that's lying around. Oh, why'd you get over there, Ned? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Tit. Alright. Hmm. Am I lost? Alright, so I can't jump on the stairs. Alright. It was going so well. jump or just did I just not Jar, do you know what this reminds me of a little bit the um the Nightmare on Elm Street game that we played oh what, what got me then can't get under there have to go this way Yeah, I'm sure it was the Nightmare on Elm Street one that we played on our horror episode. I feel like I'm going to regret going this way. Oh, that's a bloody yeah, just to get my whip out then. Till I moved. Golden jug. We all like jugs. The whip's too slow. noticed a comment in the chat room that says you're surprisingly good at this one and then I'm, I'm going to be shit for now. So it does let me whip it but it's hoofing me. Let me through. What's that? Oh, running out of time. All oh, right, fantastic. So you can't just sit and wait, then. Thank you. 
surely the big axe is going to help me with uh, that big bat. Look the other way, you know, bed. Why is he only throwing the axe one direction? Oh, referee. Let's just do one continue and see what we get. Very slow responding. Oh, don't say my hard drive's gone to sleep. Okay. Well. That's as good a place as any to stop with Castlevania 1, the first. Uh, and we're going to have a look at Castlevania 2, which, um, you know, I feel might be quite similar. For some reason, the hard drive that I've got all these on goes to sleep. You start a game, you're playing it fine, and then as soon as you try and play a different one, it's asleep. Which is why I can't continue with the other one. Okay, so. Castlevania 2. Simon's Quest. Apparently. Let's have a look. Ooh, step into the shadows of the Hell House. You've arrived back here at Transylvania for business. <laughs> Player three? What? Alright, follow this dude. Well, I can't whip him, so I'm assuming he's not a bad guy. I don't think he's damaging me. anything that I can whip yet. Whip it real good. Oh. Ooh! So vicious they bounced me back off the screen. So I can't kill the fireballs then. Tried whipping the civilians as well. They don't seem to. Uh... Oh, the water still kills you though. Oh, I see. Didn't mean player three earlier on. What a horrible night to have a curse.
can't press up or go in there. It's disappointing. Back where I started. On it's blue, not red. Uh oh. Just have to go back downstairs then. what I'm supposed to do. Die horribly at a jumping wolf man? Okay. Well, let's give the the hard drive a second to um, Yeah, I can hear it kicking in. Why is it going to sleep? So... Here we go. Oh no, it's got a menu. Uh, I've just pressed... I've just pressed... Big on the screen. everything up so let me just swap back there we go gonna die very quick I don't like those jumpy things they're a pain in the ass dead already Gonna run away from him instead. The morning sun has vanquished the horrible night. Has it though? Has it? No, no, it hasn't looked. It's still skeletons. Yeah, I don't know why I pressed jump rather than uh, bloody... Oh, fireballs! Bleeding frogmen! Oh, I can't avoid them either. Didn't think I was gonna make that one. Oh! oh it's the water. It's the water. Go 
Gonna have to get moving with them guys. Oh, I can't even jump properly. What the freaking frick? Oh, what I need to go down this bit. Oh, oh! There's no reason, no reason to go back down these bit. Why am I, why am I doing it to myself? Uh, yes, Nutty Cluster, you can get a cream for that, I believe. Fireballs. Again, why am I going down here? What's what's the blue stuff? Background. Okay. Fair enough. Oh! A rib can shield you from evil. Well, that's the weird thing to say. steps here. Oh, you can go in this one. Alright. Can't do anything, right? No whip stuff. Okay, let's move on to Castlevania 3 and then we will have done all our NES games for, for this episode. Uh. Oh, it's a bloody film. Film reel, what's going on? Castlevania 3. Lots of open MU windows, but I don't have lots of open MU windows. What's going on? What's going on? I ask you. Okay. Okay. It's a pink and yellow castle. Castlevania 3 Dracula's Curse! Okay. Oh, bit of history about Dracula. Not sure it's canon that he practiced sorcery though. People of Europe try to fight off Dracula. So it appears that the Belmont family. I mean, I think we've only just started to Simon last the last one, Simon's Quest. He was a Belmont. So it's a, a feud between two families that goes on throughout history. Fortunately, the people found a mighty Belmont called Trevor. The fate of Europe lies with Trevor. A 
enough. Should have put Derek or Keith. Well, this feels a little similar. Jump. Whippity whip. This is almost like they went ah Castlevania 2 we need a, we need to do something a bit different and they did it and they were like no nah, we don't really uh, want to do anything different so can we uh, just do Castlevania 1 again but with slightly better graphics we'll call him Trevor yeah. no one will know Oh, you got to get that jump of the whip button going at the same time. Oh, for God's sake. All right, my name's Trevor. I'm going to whip things. Came out of nowhere. Governor. How am I gonna get? Right, I can see him this time. Should have noticed it surrounded in pink the way it is. Whoa, can't jump up upstairs. Now they throw bones. Jump in Jehoshaphat. I feel like Popeye jumping the uh, jumping to get the floating hearts. Oh, Medusa! Don't know if you can whip her or not. I'm gonna try avoiding her instead. Oh, you can't avoid her. Jump off her either. Oh no, am I right back? Where am I now? I'm back at the start. Maybe this planet. For everybody. 
りは。Whip it out quick enough. Nope, did it again. Stupid. Oh, look, God damn it, I'm pressing down. Way. Probably need to get some hearts, don't I? That's uh, the deuce is going to have for me. Oh, for Pete's sake. Trev's sake, I suppose. But I want it. If I work that, it's going to drop off in it.
big fat thumbs or what? D-pad sometimes has it in for me. Okay, so that's the trilogy of uh, NES. The the first, let's say the first three, I would imagine, of NES um, Castlevania. So now we have a decision to make. What console are we going to move to next? Well, I think we might as well move to the Game Boy because it also has a game called Castlevania 2. So, and it's probably the the worst looking ones. So let's um, let's go to the Game Boy and have a look. I'll include Game Boy Advance. So we've got two Game Boy and two and three Game Boy Advanced Advance games to have a look at. So um, let's have. A look. Um, mm. Might have to buy an SSD for these uh, for these uh, ROMs if it's going to start slowing my machine down like this. I only noticed it in the past couple of past week or so, maybe. Weird. Weirdy weird. Okay. Game Boy. So obviously, black and white. I'm green and white. Oh, okay. That explains a lot. Dracula is looking to be reborn ever since his castle was destroyed. Oh, we battle with Christopher. Christopher, not Trevor or Simon, but Christopher this time. Okay. Well, it's a bit flashy, so let's uh, let's crack on and have a look. Belmont's Revenge. I'll be astounded if it's any different. Oh, you can choose how you start. Can you, though? Well, let's start here. It's where we were. Might as well start where you already are. I want to be up there. What a horrible feeling that I did. Now I've got a big axe. Ah. Let's see what's further up. This theme tune's a bit mad, isn't it? <laughs> What did that do to me? Oh, whoa! Freaking bat! Oh, 
Oh, stupid. Wrong button. Let's work along the top and then see if we need to any reason to go down to the bottom. Ooh. Wow. Freaking Zebedee. destroy those things. Oh, eyeballs. Killable eyeballs. Okay. Kill him. Well, I don't feel there's a way out of that. Energy. 
press the wrong button that time. Bah! Well, it's lucky that we have uh, more Game Boy games to look at, isn't it? Yes. Um, however, the next uh, the next one we're going to look at is um, called Castlevania: The Adventure, which possibly indicates uh, a change in gameplay style. And if it's a massive adventure game, we probably won't be playing it. I'd like to think it'd be the same size. It looks like it might be. Okay. Let's close that one. Let's open that one. The Castlevania Adventure. Let's have some adventure then. Feels quite familiar so far. Oh, it's too slow with that whip. Come on, man. some distance instead. Possible I preferred the first Game Boy one. Oh, you can't get him stood up. game that I'm not really um, liking as much as the other ones, you're not treating me very well. Jumps right. Mm. 
It's worth a try. Oh, same again. Can I hide here, do you reckon? It doesn't feel like you can get through these without hurting yourself. many birds last time. Can't whip while you're on the rope in this game. Felt you could in the last one. if it's treating me like that ah, it's just time to move on to another one isn't it okay let's move um <coughs> now i wish i had some release uh information with these because i've got three game boy advance games um but i don't know which order they were released in. Um, i suppose it doesn't really matter for our purposes um, so let's let's go in alphabetical order, shall we? A sure way to get them in the right order. I'm sure of it. Uh, right. So Game Boy Advance, a really good retro console. If you ever get a chance. Um, 
to play some Game Boy Advance games. I'm really impressed. I like, I like a Game Boy Advance. Um, okay. As you can hear, the, um... And it's huge. Yes, we've moved out of the uh, 8-bit plinky plonky disco soundtrack. In fact, I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. It's a bit of pixel on my screen. So I'm going to no, make it back to a size for you. Oh, oh, story, 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 story. Same story, story, story. Okay, so my cruise. So no Belmonts. Have we moved away from the Belmonts? Mina Hakuba. Mina. Mm, sounds familiar. Looks like he's coming too. Oh, I see what they mean. the introductions oh too late too late mate oh. we're in Dracula's castle I'm sure it said we're in Japan but we're still in Dracula's castle oh no we're inside a solar eclipse of course of course a little something like this. Well, that didn't seem like it did him any good. The spirit has entered you. Dracula's castle in a solar eclipse and we're going to meet the master oh there you go go on your adventure I've got stuff to do I've got hoovering and pots to wash oh Beds to strip. So which way are we? Oh, no, let's, let's we're going this way then. That's what we got. Jump, jump and stabby stabs. By the looks of it. Miss my wit. Yay! Got a new suit. Oh, 
I've got a dollar. Oh yeah, shit bag. Ooh! Can I have one of them? I see a joke. How do I get to that? So we've got the same sea devils from all the other ones. So yay. Oh, I can, I can knife. This time. Whoa. Let's go through this way, see what happens. Underground reservoir. Ooh. No, no, no. No, no, it's alright. I just. Now I'm gonna get stuffed again. You bastard. Oh, how do I get multiple enemies then? Tasty meat. Tasty meat. Okay, just funny. Um, I'm gonna get out. Buttons do anything else. I was enjoying this as well. So, did I miss a way out? Oh, what have we got here? How am I supposed to get to that, do you reckon? of you have watched the previous 24 episodes it's not a surprise um did i miss something probably did
All right, that's irritating. There were stairs you missed, you just missed by the start of the water. Well, thing is, if you mean these ones, they're not actually real stairs. Something somewhere. I have to. I, it's surely, surely. I think it was this, but I can't see a boat that comes near it. I should feel you might stand on the boat and then jump, and it wouldn't. Would the game expect you to sit and wait for a boat? It's not beyond the realms of possibility. Oh, all that story as well that we sat through. I mean, can I grab it? Nope. This feels too obvious. For, for it to not be something. Can I? Oh, can't make the boat move either way. Yeah, I don't think the boats come to this area. sink down to swim or anything like that none of my buttons do anything um see these boats only go backwards and forwards a little bit well if if you know where we should be going from here and you'd like to leave us a little note in the comments underneath, then we might we might come back to uh, Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. I mean, I could just I could just Google it, but that seems to be. Um, Okay, well, there's, there's, um, yes, they should rename it Area of Sorrow. Um, there's a call for comments. Comments on the video or the highlight or wherever you're watching it. Drop me a line and let me know how to get out of this section. Maybe you should never come to this section at all. And that's the trick. Perhaps you fall into this section later. Oh, I don't know. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna move on. Uh, spinning each ball as it works out. Right. We're gonna move on to the second of our Game Boy Advance games, and this is going to be Circle of the Moon. Can hear it, can't you? It's not so massive.
Okay, so where can we get stuck on this one? I wonder if it's got a massive story. In half an hour it'll be seven o'clock. It's an old Austrian, it's an Austrian castle now. Miller. That's an Austrian name, if ever I've heard one. We gave the pre we crave the presence of the embodiment of suffering, the ruler of darkness. So where, who am I? Am I playing this one as Dracula? Dracula. For statue of Dracula. in the darkness and feel the moonlight within. Maurice Baldwin. Stop. Your taint cannot be allowed in the world. Us? Yeah, we were just brushed aside and ignored. Well, he didn't even fight and say, no, no, I should stay here with you. Okay, this is me. Jump. Whip. We've got a whip back. Yay. Do I have to go drop down there then? Because it doesn't look like I can. Uh... Yep. Ooh. Whoa. What? Is it going to make me drop off this as well? Okay. Come on. Ooh. Ooh, the jump, the jump whip shit. Difficult. Can I whip upwards? Oh no, it's just a massive jump. Oh no. No, I was being stupid. Well, how am I supposed to get these? What? What is that skeleton doing? It looks like Max Wall. I... Sorry, kids. You're not going to know who that is. I got a salamander, got a charmander card. Oh, I see. We have to start getting complicated now, do we? Okay. Too complicated. Yay! Oh, 
whip makes a punching in the face noise for some reason. Only when I'm whipping a skeleton. Get out of it. This seems a little less serious, this music now. Or, I don't know. Oh. How am I supposed to do that? Use two fingers. Can I whip the bombs, do we think? Yes, I can. But I can't. Can I whip? No, I can't whip the snakes. How am I supposed to get over them then? Oh. It's got a. Has it got a bit of an 80s sitcom feel to it? Not sitcom. Something like. Um, Gauntlet. I've been poisoned. Oh, you don't get a. That's just it. Game over. Soz. You're done. It's going to let me continue. No, that's it. Okay. 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 Well, stuff that then, and let's move on to our next, uh, next one. Ah, uh, yes. Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance. I'm not sure who thinks up these uh, titles, but by golly. I think they've got a AI that's um, Castlevania Namers. Um, Harmony of Dissonance. Look, it's so dissonant, it's even upside down in a reflection. Ooh. Still has bats with red lines around them. Though. Oh, 50 years have passed since Simon Belmont vanished the curse of Dracula. Vanquished, not vanished. I knew, I knew it. Hmm, where does this sit then in the Belmont family timeline? I wonder if, if it's Derek or Keith who's going to be the hero of this one. Or Maxim. Oh, must have my headphones on funny me is writing. Oh dear. Um, can we quit the story? No, we can't. No way.
Konami, Konami, Konami. Naughty, naughty people. This feels like it might be older than the one we just played. Just, just a eh? juiced, juiced monster. My memory fails me. I I'm fine. Yeah, ladies first, I'll be right behind you. Okay, I'm I am I'm the one. Whip, whip, car whip, jump. Oh, look at that. Super jump. Yep. Oop. Well, doesn't that look like something that you should be wary of? Yep. I feel like it's going to come back alive. Yeah, I knew it. Bloody knew it. Do I have to run away from it? Do I have to whip it? No, can't whip it. It's going to come to a point now I won't be able to get any further though. Oh, I see. I wish it had told me that it was going to do that and then I didn't waste any life. Trance. See, I don't like a curtain that shows you something like that. So bad's going to happen. Probably when my back's turned. Do I prefer the slow motion jumping? How am I going to get on there, do you reckon? Oh. Okay. Massively happy about the big eyeball looking through the window, must say. At least this guy's got a whip that sort of feels like either that or I'm getting used to the Castlevania slowness, but I'm feeling the whips a little faster. the button down to get a proper jump on it though. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, we can't go anywhere. Is this a room that I have to come at from a different direction? Yep. See any other way out? Here we go again, innit? Oh, oh, what's this? See, that feels like. Uh, 
Ah. Oh, disappointed. What happened then? Oh, I hope I didn't use something I shouldn't have. That looked like it might have killed everything on the screen if there had been anything on the screen. There's another one of them then. Also, when I'm jumping, if I come down and then my whip's out, it gets gets them as well. Like that. It's annoying that you have to hold down your uh, button. Then we're, we're going to need some help in the comments and we're going to have to have a revisit because uh, I need to get that flashing door and I don't really know how to do it. Am I supposed to be doing selecting things? Okay. Oh, I don't have any spells, so it can't be that. Don't have any relics. Body goods. Maybe that thing that I got rid of before that I used by accident. Perhaps that's... Uh... Oh, well, look. It's possible we might revisit some of these uh, because, yes, I understand that uh, getting stuck on some of the earlier levels uh, is going to annoy some of you. Um, but, you know, just leave a comment. Leave a comment. Uh, but time is getting away from us. So we do need... In fact, we're not going to get through all the Castlevania ones. We're going to have to have Castlevania 2. Um, which may be, may be one of our Hmm. Perhaps it could be one of our Halloween, Halloween October episodes where we'll do another Castlevania episode and we'll we'll catch up with any comments that we've been left. We might revisit some of these games, uh, but mostly we'll do the ones that we don't get to today. And already I'm looking at someone. I'm going. You do. You know what? I'm going to move you to a different playlist. So. Um, I'll tell you what, we've been Nintendoing all all evening, so let's have a look. 
at uh, the Mega Drive, or the Genesis, depending on where you're from. And uh, this is Castlevania, the new generation. Not the next generation, the new generation. Uh, and we'll see what the Mega Drive made of Castlevania. And the window is open, and there it is, new generation. Oh, I, I see that um, Nutty Closed is saying that she's annoyed, but I, I, I chat so far behind, I don't actually remember. I don't know what she's annoyed for. But uh, we're on the Mega Drive now, so it doesn't matter. Let's have a look. Sega. John Morris, Eric Lacard. Oh, I don't know. Eric's got a big sticky thing for sticking. does John have? His weapon is he's a vampire killer. That's his weapon. Oh, come on. We've got to see what that is. Ruins of the Castle Dracula, Romania. A whip I see before me. Oh. Oh, it's the Mega Drive, isn't it? Oh, poop. Right, okay. So, six, three, three buttons, six buttons, Mega Drive. Um, but the buttons have changed. I need to avoid them. Maybe not. I mean, as you can see, fairly similar. Um, is it so similar that we're going to get caught somewhere that we don't know what we're doing in a minute? We are. Almost guarantee it. Wow, they're moving quick. Oh, I didn't move quick enough. Is that like Mario's super thing where I won't get any damage. It is. I like it. No, I want more of that, please. Stairs without paying attention. Bloody merman. They're gonna fire. I knew they were gonna fireball me. Oh, oh I'm not that greedy. I'm going back upstairs. Dude, you again. Keep 
press the wrong button for jump. Bats are just coming in a little too quick for me. Is that something you want to see? Oh, there, Leslie. Get in there! Yeah, I know it was the first boss and it was dead easy, but get in there! Well, that's not good, is it? Now what? Uh, can't help but feel I'm going to get hurt if I walk through that. Oh, okay. Why is it there? Is it just for decoration?
Which way now? Am I going to regret going up here? No. Is there any reason other than that? No. to go that way to get out. Oh. Go that way, gotta go this way. Can't do that though. Bugger. Come down here. Come down here. Come on. Come on, come down here, you little bastard. Come on. Well, I'm, I wonder if I can just keep running. Can I keep running? Can I keep running? Why did it let me do that? Right. Tasty meat. So, why will it not let me get any further through? Is it just for the tasty meat? How annoying. that I can jump over there. Yeah, I'm trapped now. Nowhere through there. Oh. Well, how are we I'm going to get birded now, aren't I? Castlevania, the new generation, on the Mega Drive. Sorry, can't believe it. Um, so, the other... One, two, three, we've got three more. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to play one more and move the others to... Uh, to the next Castlevania-themed... Horror night. Um, you can tell the plans for October are coming together slowly, piece by piece, during this episode, as uh, as we play things. So, uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to save the PlayStation version, and we're going to save the DS version, 
and we're going to save... Did I say I had three? I've got four. Uh, and we, we probably will save the <coughs> the N64 version. And we'll go back in time a little bit. Because this is um, on the SNES. And our last game tonight is going to be called Super Castlevania 4. Yep. So maybe we should have played it after three. But it brings us that in a nice circle, kind of. Um, so, then. Super Castlevania 4 on the SNES. Let me get you a SNES window. No, no. Uh, if you've got anything that you'd like to, um, to see... I may say this again at the end, but if you've got anything you'd like to see on the show during October, something horror, horror related, then um, feel free to uh, to message us, let us know, you know, um, and we'll certainly add it in. We do like uh, October and Halloween in uh, in the snug, so um, yeah, be interesting. Okay. As we're going back to the snares, I suspect we may recognize some of the gameplay. Well, let's be honest, if you've seen the Prince of Persia one, this this hasn't Castlevania hasn't pissed me off in the same way that um, that Prince of Persia did. And even Metroid to some extent, although as we all know. Metroidvania is a thing. So, and they do play very similarly. Ooh, is it a gravestone? Ooh, spooky. Oh, gravestones are expensive. That's going to cost something. Like that. Story again. The power of Dracula starts to revive itself. Mm. Enough. <laughs> Change the buttons again. Oh, soddy. Doopy doo, doopy doo. Where's Enter? It's gonna confuse it, innit? Okay. Right, let's see where the buttons are now. Whippity whip, jumpy jump. Right, we're back to the Nintendo scheme again. Yeah, I feel like these are things we pick up straight away. Yes, I've got to get the one up there. You know I have. Before it all starts going to shit. Did I just see myself? Uh, not horizontally, diagonally. That skeleton just moonwalk then. Not sure I want to be behind there as I can't see what's going on properly. Might not have any choice. Oh, it's that 
from this side. Yeah. How can I get back through? Maybe I can't. What was that thing with the blue and blue and can't get back? Oh no. I've got a propeller. Oh. Well, I thought I could have at least... Yeah, I like the diagonal width. Can't get through anywhere though. Grey blocks are for walking. No, no, no! Probably wanted that. Ah, oh, yeah. Rebel skull. Is that hurting me? I was whiffing it. Is that not a... Is it? Got a shit whip now. That's better. Nobody wants a shit whip. Oh, I got the jump this time. For some reason.
clock tower and I hit it. Is it gonna kill it? Oh, well, fuck off. Oh, that was demoralizing at this time of night. Um, so demoralizing that um, I think, I think we're done. If you want to see more of Super Castlevania on the SNES, then um, just let me know. Just let me know. But we've hit two hours um, so it's time to uh, do the wheel and get the hell out of here. So let's uh, get to this wheel. Pop this open. Not sure why it's not showing again. Well, that's irritating. <laughs> oh, come on. Why, why? Maybe if I... No. Oh, do you know what? I'm just going to do it like that. Yay. Okay. Uh, so, like, I, like I've... Uh, like I said in the past, we're... Um, we're getting to a stage that we're going to run out of things on the wheel and we're going to be putting the other things back on again. But what we'll do is we'll not change it during September. Then we'll work out what we're doing for our shows in October and bring it back. Oh, bring it back for Christmas, for December. Well, no, it needs to be back for November, doesn't it? And then we'll work out what we're doing for Christmas. Oh, so many plans. Anyway, here's the wheel. Let's spin it and see what we're doing next week. Oh, another one. Another I have never played. Oh. Oh, just so... so. <laughs> Okay, I've never played any Zelda games. Um, so next week we'll be rectifying that with a whole bunch of Zelda games. Or Link, Zelda Link, all that sort of interwoven franchise. Um, we'll... Yeah. Yeah, we'll do exactly what we've done this week. But... We'll do it with um, we'll do it with Zelda rather than Castlevania, so so that's it. That's the end of episode twenty five of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Um, you can email us retro at snugradio.co.uk, retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's also the website snugradio.co.uk, mostly centered around our podcast that's been running for eighteen years. Um, so, what else is there? We're on Facebook, we're on Twitter, we're on uh, TikTok. Yes, all as Snug Radio. Um, if you're not watching this live now, you'll be watching it on YouTube, which means you know about our YouTube channel, Snug Radio. Um, so, all these places, it would be super if you would give us uh, a like and share. Share with your friends. More importantly, share with your friends. Share with everybody. It doesn't have to be your friends. Just just. Share it with everybody. Um, like and subscribe and ring bells if we have bells where you're watching this. Um, all, all the things. Uh, did I say TikTok? We're on TikTok as well. Um, I think that's everything. I think that's everything. So, if uh, if we're on the internet, we're on the internet at Snug Radio. So if you just go there and do all the things that you'd like to do, that would be so, until next week, when we have a look at Zelda, uh, I've been Math. This has been Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Play something retro. I'll be back next week. Goodbye. Goodbye.